you're always buying whole wheat crackers all the time because you think they're going to be way better for you and actually they aren't way better for you, really was it worth it? Hey there, Coach Devin here. I am at the grocery store again. I spent a lot of time at the grocery store and today uh, I was buying crackers. Kids like crackers a lot. And I want to show you the difference between whole wheat crackers, which is what I would normally buy. Like I always go with the whole wheat crackers over just the regular, no nonsense, whatever crackers. There's my wife, say hi, Dev. Hi. She doesn't always love being on YouTube, I'll be honest. <laughs> but she's not a huge fan of me talking at the grocery store either. All right, so let's take a look at this. So as we can see, this is the whole wheat crackers. Seven crackers, 90 calories, 200 milligrams of sodium, 50 milligrams of potassium, some calcium, iron. All right, on the other side, seven crackers, 90 calories, carbohydrates at 16, two milligrams of, sorry, two grams of protein, 20 grams of potassium, so slightly different than potassium. Calcium, there's none there. Iron, a little bit more. So what is this? What this tells you is there's not an enormous difference between whole wheat crackers and regular crackers. Now, let's be familiar. Whole wheat crackers are a little bit better for you. And when I say a little bit better for you, I mean like a little bit better for you. It's not significant. Not enough that if you don't have a balanced diet, you're gonna even notice the difference. That is what it's like when you really boil things down. Quite often, I would, like everybody else, be like, I'm getting whole wheat, whole wheat's gonna be so much better for me. In reality, the whole wheat is not really significantly different. And cost-wise, quite often the whole wheat costs more. In this case, the whole wheat actually is 50 cents more per box. Now that's not a lot. I understand it's not a lot, but if you're always buying whole wheat crackers all the time because you think they're going to be way better for you and actually they aren't way better for you, really was it worth it? So the, the takeaway from this is actually very simple. You can buy whole wheat if you want. Yes, it is slightly, and I mean slightly, slightly, slightly more healthy, or you can just get the regular crackers and have it and be over with that because in reality you don't need to go bananas with stuff you can you can just have the normal crackers they're really about the same when it boils right down they're about the same what am i going to do right now i'm buying the normal crackers because the girls like normal crackers i'm just going to buy them it's simpler that way sometimes guys it is easier to just go with what's there and that's why it's so important to read the side of things if you don't read the side of things you don't know this i would have honest to God, would have looked at that, and I assumed that the whole wheat crackers would be significantly more healthy. They're like that much more healthy. It's not really worth it. The girls don't like them that much. They complain when I go home. It's just not worth doing it. So we're going to go with just the regular normal crackers. That's what we're going with today. If you have comments, questions, things you want to talk about, things you want me to look up and talk about on YouTube, write them up down below. I would love to hear from you. That's why I make these videos, trying to help people get more healthy and fit and make decisions like this at the grocery store. Have yourself an amazing day, everybody. Don't fight the awesome.